President Recep Tayyip Erdogan has announced that his office decided to give Religious Affairs Directorate President Mehmet Gourmet a new armored car as a gesture following a controversy over a previously purchased TL1 million car for the top imam. The president, who became personally involved in the controversy by opposing Gourmet returning the car in the face of public reaction, announced during an interview aired on a pro-government channel on Thursday that one of the armored cars serving the presidency will be given to Gourmet. We, the office of the president, decided to do this giving something which befits the post of the Religious Affairs Directorate President as a gesture following the rudeness shown to our Religious Affairs Directorate President, Erdogan said. The car initially purchased for Gourmet was not armored. Earlier this month, Gourmet said his office would return a recently purchased official car that sparked controversy after reports showed that it cost TL 1 million. Erdogan, however, at a rally in Belgium lashed out at critics, saying if he had known about Gourmet's plans to return the car, he would have recommended that his religious affairs directorate president not do so. This post well deserves such a car, he added. Erdogan also spoke out against critics in new comments last week, saying Gourmet was so upset by the criticism that he got out of the car and walked home after he saw a picture of himself on social media portrayed with a Mercedes emblem on his turban. The remarks appear to contradict the account of Gourmet, who recently insisted during a televised interview that he had never actually used the car. In separate remarks, Erdogan said that most of those who are putting forward the slander are using Mercedes vehicles. What is so wrong with our Grand Religious Affairs Directorate President using such a car for his official duties? Erdogan had said in a rally in the eastern province of Van.